Hi, Penny. How are you doing? Have you just been to the gym? Hi, Debbie. I'm good, thanks. Yes, I've just finished a workout. How are you? Yes, good. I'm planning on going to the gym later, but it's hard finding the time now I've got a child. <laughs> I bet it is. Have you tried any of their new exercise classes? Yes, I tried some last week. I wanted to go to yoga, but it was full up. I went to the dance class instead. It was really fun. Oh, and kickboxing last Thursday too. <laughs> That was exhausting. Well, you didn't miss much at yoga. I went there last Friday and it was far too hard. I couldn't do most of the exercises. Oh, no. Are you going to try anything else? Well, I was thinking of trying the aerobics class. My friend did that one and said the instructor was awful. Well, I'll probably give it a miss then. I've got to go to a conference next week anyway, so I'll be away from Tuesday to Friday. Oh, lucky you. OK, Alice. I just need a few more details to start your membership. Your full name is Alice Wilson, yes? No, Watson. Oh, yes. I'm sorry. Which age range are you? Well, I'm just out of the 16 to 25 bracket. I'm 26 now. Great. 26 to 35. Yes. And do you have any health problems which may affect your exercise? No, I don't have any health conditions. I'll put none. Do you do any exercise at the moment? Not much. I exercise a couple of times a week. And what do you do? Well, I used to play tennis, but I stopped. Now I only go swimming. OK. And why have you decided to join up? Just to improve my fitness. I don't want to lose any weight or build muscles or anything. Fine. Well, I would recommend doing the Level 2 workout programme to begin with. It takes about 40 minutes to do the whole programme. I'll get you an information sheet so you can see what it involves. Thank you for taking the time to see me today, Mr Jones. I'd just like to take a minute to outline our new step machines. No problem. I'm interested in getting a few. We don't have any in the gym yet. That's great. Well, let me talk you through the build of the step machine. If you have a look at the sales brochure, you can see what they look like on page 14. OK. These machines are two metres tall, so they tend to stand out. The tallest part is the holding frame. At the top there, we have the main grips. These grips, when they are held, monitor heart rate so that the user can check they are working out at their optimum heart rate. That's great. And where does this rate show up? They'll be able to see it on the screen below. This screen is fully digital and shows not only their heart rate, but the number of steps they've taken and the distance they've travelled. On the panel there, they also have a selection of workouts. They can set it by distance or time or by the amount of calories they want to burn. They can even set it to climb a famous mountain or hill or walk up the Leaning Tower of Pisa, for example. <laughs> That's great. I like those more fun settings. And the great thing is you can have people climbing up Mount Everest, for example, every day for 10 years, and this machine will still be in perfect working order. It's made to last. It not only has a metallic spine, but durable pedals made from the most high-tech materials on the market. And the machine works via a wheel in the centre. That's unusual, isn't it? Yes, it is. But we find a central wheel lasts much longer than a pump system. The central wheel is attached to a bracket, which ensures each step movement is as smooth as the last. Uh, the final feature I should point out to you is the side supports, which ensure safety for all machine users. If users feel tired, they can hold on to these and slow down their stepping. I see. Well, I think I might take three of them. Section 1. You will hear a conversation in a gym between a customer and a receptionist. First, you will have 20 seconds to look at questions 1 to 3. You will see that there is an example which has been done for you. On this occasion only, the conversation related to this will be played first. Hello and welcome to Smith's Gym. Hi there. I'd like to become a member. Yes, of course. We just need to fill out a couple of forms and then I can show you around the gym. That would be great. Let's start with the membership form. Can I have your name, please? Yes, sure. Brad Simmons. 
Is that Simmons with a D or without? Without. S I double M O N S. The customer says that his surname is Simmons, so this is written as the answer. Now we shall begin. You should answer the questions as you listen, because you will not hear the recording a second time. Listen carefully and answer questions one to three. Hello and welcome to Smith's Gym. Hi there. I'd like to become a member. Yes, of course. We just need to fill out a couple of forms, and then I can show you around the gym. That would be great. Let's start with the membership form. Can I have your name, please? Yes, sure. Brad Simmons. Is that Simmons with a D or without? Without. S I double M O N S. Got it. And can I take a contact number, please? Yes, sure. It's zero four nine eight three. Treble five two one. Okay, zero four nine eight three five 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 three one. No, ah,、uh, it's two one at the end. Great. And do you have an email address? Yes, Brad zero seven at elmnet dot com. That's e l e m n e t dot com. Right. Now. We've got three membership types here: bronze, which is just off peak and costs twenty-one pounds a month; silver, which means you can use the gym at all times. This is thirty-six pounds fifty, or for just five pounds more, you can get a gold membership, which gives you free access to the squash and tennis courts and all classes. For now, I think I'll just take the silver. That's fine, sir. That'll be thirty-six pounds fifty a month. Great. When can I start? Well, you'll need to have an induction first. We have spaces at two thirty, four forty-five, and eight fifteen tomorrow. Would any of these be suitable? I can't do tomorrow. Do you have anything for Saturday? Is that the twelfth of November? No, it's the eleventh. Yes, yes, that's fine. Would two thirty be okay? That's fine. I'll book you in with our trainer, Rob Ellis. Now, would you like me to show you around? That would be great. Okay, follow me. Let's go up the stairs to the main equipment room. As you can see, we have all the treadmills, bikes, and rowing machines in here, and the weights are in the corner. Great. And is that the pool over there? Can I use that with my membership? Yes, at any time. Just go through the glass doors on the left. As you can see, the pool is dominated by the diving board at the far end. It's impressively tall, and on the right-hand side of the pool, you can see we have two lanes. The first one is a slow lane for those who are trying to improve their fitness. It gets really busy. The lane on the far right is what we call the club lane because we reserve this for people who have membership. It is slightly less busy, and the members can get a really good workout in it. That sounds great. Yes, it is good. And then near us, you can see a smaller area sectioned off nearly halfway across the pool. This area is where we put the school groups, which come in the late afternoons during the week, usually from about four. We keep them confined to that space so that the other end can be used for free swimming. And what is the little round pool for? We call that the toddler's pool. It's not very deep, and the mothers often bring their children in to teach them to swim in it. Great. Well, I'm glad I can use the pool. It will be good to vary my exercise. Definitely. When do you think you'll be coming? Most likely in the evenings. I'd like to come on Saturdays, but I often work then, so I think I'll have to miss that day and then come on Sundays. Oh, so you'll be a regular visitor. That's great news. Can I ask why you chose Smith's Gym? Well, actually, the television advert prompted me to join. It makes exercising look so much fun. I always thought going to the gym would be monotonous. No, not at all. It can be a lot of fun. My aim is to reach my optimum fitness. At the moment, I think I'm a bit unhealthy, so I'd like to change that. Well, give it some time, and I'm sure you will. Now, shall we go back and complete the payment details?